You guys can probably hear the thunder going on outside. There is a severe thunderstorm going on outside right now, and I don't have any network here at the office. I drove over here. I kind of expected not to have internet because of the severe storm. It's been going on for a few hours now, torrential downpours, local flooding. So I'm just going to do one of these quick phone vlogs today. And since I can't get on the internet, I'm not even going to check like show notes or anything, anything I had planned. What I'm going to do is speak off the cuff a little bit about life tips. Every now and then I do one of these videos where I try to give you guys life tips, life advice. And you guys seem to enjoy when I do these kinds of off-topic videos every now and then. So today I wanted to talk to you about a method of living. And that method is be, do, have, and not have, do, be. What I'm talking about is be, do, have, be. What do you want to be? Right? What is your goal? Who do you want to become in life? That is the be. And then the do part is what you have to do to become what you want to be, right? And then the have part is ultimately the goal. What is it you want to achieve? What do you want to acquire, right? Many people do this in completely the reverse direction. Many people do things in a have, do, be fashion where they try to have the things that, for example, let, let's say you want to be a successful businessman. I see this all the time with these people that say they want to become successful at, at business and they go and buy an expensive car. They go buy that Lamborghini or whatever. And, you know, because that's what a successful businessman has. They have to look the part, right? They have to dress nice. They have to have the expensive car. They have to have the good looking girl, right? Because that's the things that a successful businessman would have. And they figure if they have these things, then they will be a successful businessman. But you can't do things in reverse order. Just having that stuff doesn't mean all of a sudden you can then do what a successful businessman does. And it doesn't mean that you can be a successful businessman because you've got it all twisted. But you see this all the time. These people that try to do things in reverse order, they'll go into debt. They'll go buy expensive clothes, expensive car, you know, and, and they don't get anywhere because they think they can just skip ahead in line as far as the progression of things. You see this all the time with musicians. As a former musician myself, well, I am a musician, but somebody who went to school for music, and I've seen a lot of professional musicians, I've seen people imagine that they were rock stars, right? Like they were famous rock stars and everybody knew them, everybody loved them. You see this all the time, even in traffic, you'll look at the car next to you and you'll see somebody singing along with the radio as loud as they can with this rock tune on this radio, and in their head, you know, they imagine they're on stage in front of thousands of people and everybody loves them. People are, are throwing, you know, hotel keys and babies at them because they're, they're so great, right? And again, because they're trying to play the part of a rock star rather than actually doing the work to actually be a rock star and then doing the things a rock star does, which is making records, going on tour, things like that, right? And then ultimately you will have what a rock star has, which of course is the fame and fortune. And this is how you have to do in life. Be, do, have, not have, do, be. So figure out what you want to be first. If you want to be a successful businessman or a successful musician or, you know, do you want to be a good husband, a good father, a good Christian, a good Muslim? You know, whatever it is that ultimately is your goal, and then focus on being that thing. And then ultimately, when you start being that thing, fundamentally, I am that thing, naturally, you will do the things that that kind of person does. And then ultimately you will have the things that that person should have. So just don't get things twisted in life. Always start by be, not have, right? Go in the right order. Be, do, have, not have, do, be. All right, guys. Peace.